can't remember exactly where I met Shape. I just remember when I saw his work, I was blown away and I just had to work with him. When I looked at his work, it reminded me of Dolly and I seen his Dolly influences. But then at the same time, I also saw this modern take on it. And at the same time, I was also looking at an artist that was too talented for the underground. It's like he should be in galleries. When it's all said and done, and I'm six feet under, I guess I'd want to be remembered for just doing good art and art that's meaningful to people and uh, can bring emotion to somebody. And I guess that'll be the main thing I want to be remembered for. Shay's work is, is uh, I would call it cross-platform. I mean, he, he fits really well into the, the pop surrealist scene. because it, it works off classic surrealism, um, but it also is dealing with contemporary uh, issues and contemporary pop iconography, like uh, a painting he just brought in a day, little toy soldiers, plastic toy soldiers, and things like that. I mean, that, that's new style. Do Dolly had no point of reference for plastic toy soldiers, so surrealism can kind of fall into that category of highly illustrative artworks that dig up old, old ideas or pop iconography to talk about bigger things or to not talk about anything whatsoever. Um, and he fits perfectly into that.